And we are joined on the phone now by our reporter Liu Yang, who is at the Chengdu Panda Reserve. Hello there, Liu Yang. First of all, can you tell Hello, us more me. about the ceremony on Wednesday? Yes, um, this morning, the six pandas have been um, officially released to China Panda Valley. Uh, the Panda Valley is located in Zhujiang Yan, Sichuan, Sichuan province. Um, the specialist says that these six pandas will stay here for at least five to ten years or even longer um, than that depends on the results of the wildness training. And um, the retired NBA star uh, and ambassador of wild animals, Yao Ming, attended the panda reintroduction ceremony for the release of the six pandas. And after the ceremony, Yao Ming opened the cage and released the uh, panda from her cage. Mm -hmm. uh, he told us that uh, he's been working with several NGOs on protecting the endangered species and the wild animals. Mm -hmm. And about the, uh, our main characters in the ceremony, the six giant pandas, can you tell us more about the reasons for conditioning uh, these pandas before sending them back into the yes, wild? Ming. Yes, Sony, I talked with one of the specialists and he says that if the captive bred pandas are not trained, and they will not be able to find food by themselves. And uh, in the wild, they will have a difficulty finding shelter, uh, especially in the winter. Without the wild nature, they don't know what to expect from other animals. And the most importantly, right now, the captive bred pandas are fully reliant on humans. So therefore, uh, the success of the training of the captive bred pandas are vital uh, to the entire population of the wild pandas. Mm -hmm. All right, thank you very much, Louis. I'm reporting from uh, the Chengdu Panda Reserve.